Hey guys, I am Psychic Mara. Real quick, there is a 64-year-old man from the UK, West Yorkshire, and he went for his late afternoon run with his dog and he never returned home. Um, he just vanished. He's missing. It's very urgent. So I'm not going into all the details. However, I will leave specific details in the description box if you don't mind reading that. Okay. My intentions is to kind of see what happened, tap into his energy and see exactly what happened and where he could be located if I'm able to help. Um, everything is allegedly my opinion. Again, he's 64. Um, oh gosh, nice looking man. And he was last seen, uh, you know, taking a run with his female dog. So here's the thing, him and the dog is missing. So I, I feel right away that they are together. They will be found. It's already starting. Oh my gosh. Yep. They will be found. Um, they are definitely together. I don't pick up any kind of foul play. Um, sorry, I know I'm going right in here, but I wanted to rush and do this. Um, I don't pick up foul play. I pick up a terrible accident. Uh, oh, Mr. Graham, I'm so, so sorry. Um, oh, man, what it looks like in my vision is that he slipped he slipped. He may have slipped and, and, and there's some type of big accident. If the searchers keep looking, they will discover him and the dog. Um, they are very close, meaning they're not far apart. They may find this dog or puppy first, or they may just find them both together are not far apart. I keep picking up. He will be found soon. The dog will be found as well. He is very hurt. Um, I, I'm keeping my fingers crossed because I feel like he's a fighter. Mentally, he's a fighter. He is. And, and I feel like he's trying to hang on until someone can come in and help him. And, and that's what I'm picking up for this, this guy right here. He's got really powerful energy as well. I'm really feeling it. I'm feeling like he's fighting until he can't fight anymore. What I mean here is this man wants to be found. Okay. Um, I have my fingers crossed. And I have high hopes. I do know he will be found. The problem is I, I just, I have my fingers crossed that it's not too late because I feel his energy like fighting, like find me, find me. And they're so close. So we're going to hear within the coming hours and even the coming days, um, I feel like it's sooner, sooner than the coming days. It's going to be within hours. Uh, we will hear news about Mr. Graham. Okay. Uh, and again, it's so interesting because they found his car, his Mercedes. I, I think they say at, at, uh, close by, nearby, okay, at an entrance gate, they, they found his vehicle there, so he's in that area somewhere, and I keep seeing in my vision that he's fighting mentally, he's trying to hang on, Ugh. he's been missing since 18th December, I believe, I, I, um, yeah, I'm going to put the specific details in the description, I'm, I'm rushing, you can even hear it in my voice, I just want to tap in here, and, oh, I'm so sorry that this happened because I can honestly say he was really going for his usual run with, with the family dog. He really was. His intentions was to, to come back home. And there's no foul play. At least I don't pick it up. I see a terrible accident. I see like a slip and fall. I'm also seeing a ditch, a canal, or something like that. Uh, um, ah. Uh, some kind of uh, 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 outside drainage or something like that, like a big hole or something. Um, I do see a lot of water in, in like kind of like grassy mud around him. I keep picking up. They're going to find the puppy, something about the dog or the puppy. Uh, I don't like this feeling. I mean, oh, uh, they must hurry. And I know they're doing everything they can. When I say this is urgent, it's really urgent. I just pick up that he's fighting. He's fighting. He's, in other words, he's trying to hold on to hope. He wants to be found and he's making peace. He's making peace with God just in case that doesn't happen. Um, so I'm hoping they do find him, um, um, alive. That's what I'm hoping for. Unfortunately, 
unfortunately, as I'm even explaining and talking to you guys, I can feel that time is quickly running out. He's making peace. Okay, he's a fighter. He's trying to hang on. And I hate that this happened to him. Um, and it can happen to any of us. He was just, you know, jogging kind of, you know, uh, some, some a place that he frequents a lot, that he goes to a lot. And um, there was an accident. I, I keep picking up like a ditch, a drainage, a hole, or, or somewhere around that water. Ugh, I, yeah, that's what I have, okay? God bless this man and his family, and we will hear something, I feel, very soon, okay? Uh, yeah, keeping high hopes, okay? Thanks for listening. Bye.